Hello world, Hi, Thrills here. Thank you so much for following your intuition that led you right here, right now. Today I'm gonna to show you how to get in to proper alignment in a lunge from a couple different positions. We'll start from standing. So with your feet hip width apart, find your ankles, knees, and hips stacked. For viewer's sake, I'm gonna start on my right side. Send your right leg back. I'd like to just drag it on my mat until my legs feel nice and separated. Oftentimes, I see people here walking a tightrope. Step out the length of your mat. You can even heel toe your front leg out to the side and make sure your back leg is out to the side too. We want a 90 degree angle with this leg. So ankle and knee in one line, parallel thigh to the floor. A lot of the time I see that knee coming out, you want to pull it in, okay? That requires squeezing the hips and dragging them forward. So keep that bend in the front knee, and now we'll assess the back leg. It can be bent as much as you need to support the knees, the hips being forward, or you can try to extend energy throughout that back heel. So boom, we're here. You can bring your arms around, feel that stretch through the hips. And what we'll do is we'll bring the hands forward so that I can show you how to switch it out. A lot of times in yoga classes, we'll switch it out through a downward dog. So press your hips back to your heels by bending your knees. Inhale the hips up. A lot of the time we'll take, a, we'll take one leg up, the teacher will call, and then you'll send your knee to your nose, shoulders over the wrist, and replace your foot with your hand. So from here, you can notice my feet are a little bit more forwards than my knee. So I just bend in, remember to pull my hips together to trap the knee inside, lift up, square off the hips, straighten up the back leg, pressing energy through that heel. Inhale, circle around. Exhale, down. Something fun to do is keeping that bend in the front knee, drag your back foot up, and you can lift up. You can take it anywhere you want from there. So that's how you get in and out of a lunge from downward dog and from standing. Also, if that's difficult, we can always choose the beginner's mind, which is a great way to go, by if you're here in tabletop, you send your knee to your elbow, replace the foot with the hand. Remember that length between. You want to be as, you could be as wide as your hips or as wide as the mat and keep the back knee down to set up the hips, keep that the uh, thighs pulling together, knee over ankle, then you can tuck your back toes and lift up your back knee. Maybe you need to shimmy the leg back a little bit. Also a nice, gentle way to get into it. And this is always chill, to have your knee down in your lunge, in your practice, if that means that you have proper alignment, because alignment on the inside is alignment on the outside. Thank you so much. If there's anything that you want to learn more about, or if you want to just chat, spread love, throw it in the comments. Peace.